Lewis Hamilton's theory has been dismissed after the United States Grand Prix. Lewis Hamilton's theory that the latest Mercedes upgrade package may have caused both his and teammate George Russell's spins at the United States Grand Prix has been dismissed by Toto Wolff. The seven-time world champion had a rare off weekend at the Circuit of the Americas, making errors in both sprint and main qualifying, as well as struggling to a P6 finish in the sprint race on Saturday. Then, after gaining five positions on the opening lap from an unprecedented P-17 grid slot, Hamilton appeared to make an uncharacteristic error, dropping the rear of his car at turn 19 on the third lap of the race, leaving him beached in the gravel and out of the race. Speaking after the race, Hamilton was still at a loss to describe what happened, but theorized. In P-1, I had the same thing. I had the spin in turn three, which is so rare. I have never spun in turn three in all the years I've been here. I was just saying about George obviously having the same problem yesterday. He has gone back to the old spec car and is looking good out there, so maybe there is something with the new upgrade. He later added, I wasn't even pushing at that point. I was literally just trying to get going and bringing the tires up to temperature. The car started bouncing, the left front started bouncing, and the rear end just came round. It was the same as George yesterday. When asked about Hamilton's theory, team principal Wolf disagreed. I don't think we have a fundamental issue on the upgrade very much, he said. My thinking is it's more interaction on aero and on mechanical stuff. Therefore, we're going to continue with the upgrade. It makes no sense to not because there's a lot of lap time you leave on the table. However, on the other side, you need to be very open-minded. George drove the July upgrade on Sunday because we didn't have the new floor, and that seemed pretty competitive.